Public works crews are continuing the cleanup process from the snow we got a few weeks ago, and with more snow means a fresh new start. Cameron Brewer picks up where he left off to show us how crews are dealing with things all in stride. A lot of times we don't even get it cleaned up from the first time and it snows and just start over and deal with it. Crews are now also completing the task of widening the streets and pushing snow away from the curb. Roads are kind of slippery in this cold weather. We're widening streets to the curb, get the snow ridge at least to the curb. We are uh, plowing around parked cars where cars have moved. Like any job the crew must get done, there are interruptions, like cars parked on the street while they're plowing. So it does create a problem when there's parked cars there where it slows us down. Then we got to go back when those cars are moved. We got to push the snow over. This is when Bismarck police have to get involved. First, they start with locating the driver in order to get them to move the vehicle. I've been here 29 years and we've always had always had problems with that. It's it's not a it's not a huge issue, but it does require an officer has to come out and try to locate the owner. Worst case scenario, we have to impound the car and there's ticketing for violators. Sometimes people will call and then learn about the parking requirements during winter storms. Generally, that eliminates the problems where where we do have the problems is people that have never been ticketed before, so they're not aware of the rules. And then all of a sudden they're doing storm removal and it becomes a problem. Reporting at Bismarck for KX News, I'm Cameron Brewer. Solomon's Us adds on average, they only issue about 12 tickets during the entire win winter season, and they do tend to locate drivers to prevent those citations and impounds. Now,